Hey, my friends, this is Jeff Yaldin. I am making my dinner tonight. It's going to be a juice, and I want to share with you what I'm doing. Yo, um, it's raining mad here in Myrtle Beach, South Carolina. I am not naked. I've just been dripping wet all day. I did get my round of golf in. So um, let's get prepared to see what we're about to do here. Right now, I am preparing my... Uh, Juicer, I've got my bag in here that I told you about that's going to collect everything. I whip that out, throw it away, and I'm going to put all of the stuff here together. And then um, I'm going to show you in a second all the veggies and fruits I'm going to use. So don't go away. Okay, my friends, we're back, and uh, I'm looking forward to sharing with you what I do. Again, I am not naked. It's been raining. I played golf. I've got my shorts on. Okay, so. I have my juicer, and what we're gonna do now is we're gonna throw a good handful of spinach right in there. Actually, you know what? We're gonna make it two handfuls. Just grab it, and you just push it right on in there. Again, the better it is for you, the less juice is gonna get extracted into the juicer, but that's the point there, so. As you can see there, we are getting some juice in there. We definitely want more. So what I'm gonna do now is, let's take some kale. Again, same thing. Just grab yourself a couple handfuls, throw it right in there. 80% vegetables, 20% fruit. I love the sound that it's just like, Zipping, it's extracting all that juice. To me, it's like it's like the machine is saying, Oh, this is so good. All right, so we've got the spinach and the kale. Now, what we're going to do is you can see right here, I have all of my fruits. I have I have uh, carrots, I have some tomato, I've got the beets, I've got ginger, I've got cucumber, I've got celery, I've got some peach, and I have a lemon. So let's put all that in the juicer. Oops, sorry about that, I'm doing this by myself here. All right, are you ready? <laughs> all right, so first, throw in the tomato, we'll throw in the carrots, mm. man, that's like just going to be so good, alright, let's throw in the beet, what I do is take part of the bottom of the beet, the, the red thing, I don't know, it's good for something, they say it's good, and then I take the leaves and the, kind of like the stem. Just throw that whole sucker right on in there. Yeah. Man, that turns, that juice look, it turns it like red. So awesome. All right, now let's take our peach. Boom. I got some more kale and spinach laying around. Boom. All right. Here's our cucumber, boom, celery, boom. You just throw it right in there, it's zippy. Here's the ginger, just throw it in there. There you go. Let's throw in the apple, we'll give it some taste. Bam, bam. There you go. Apple, apple, boom. The lemon will cut in half. There you go, just throw it right in there. Oh God. And there you go. You take a quick look down in there, looks good, right? Yep. All right. All right, my friends, that's, um, a lot of you have been asking, say, so, hey Jeff, how, how do you juice? How do you start? You know what, you just start. You just do it, so. Uh, all right, I'm gonna show you what I'm talking about right here. Now here's the juice that we just made. 
I'm gonna pour it into, look at that, oh man. Look how much juice that is. Look at that. Oh, look how much that made. Oh yeah. I am making a little mess here, but. <sighs> That's good stuff, my friends. That's good stuff. I hope you uh, take part in juicing. It's given me an incredible amount of new energy, including yoga and my workout of the day. I'm feeling probably in the best shape I've ever felt in my life. I'm not one to put veggies on my plate. All my life, that's all I've ever heard. Eat your veggies, eat your veggies. I remember my friend in New York growing up, he used to take his peas and put them up his nose. He hated veggies too. Put your broccoli on your plate. You put your broccoli on your plate. I'm juicing. I like the benefit of fruits and vegetables. Juicing for me is the way to go. If you have any questions, you know how to find me. I hope you enjoy. Thanks for watching. Okay, my friends, so we're all done with juicing and we cleaned up. And one of the things I hear a lot from people is how hard it is to clean up. Here's a tip. When you're done and before you drink your juice, clean up right away so that it doesn't dry, harden, and make it hard. So I showed you the juice. I'm all done cleaning up, and here's what I'm going to do. There it goes, right in the dishwasher. Close it up, and boom, all done, ready for the next juice. Thanks again for watching.